It's finally here. Picking up a package for apartment 323. What's up guys? I am super excited because I have the iPhone 11 Pro Max. I've been waiting all week for this guy and it's it's finally here and I wanna do a quick unboxing, show you guys what's in the box and kind of what I'm excited for. Um, I plan on doing a iPhone vlog because apparently the best thing about this new phone is the camera. So I'm gonna kind of show you guys all the new features about the phone and yeah, and then do a vlog like I said and maybe launch, put that out next week. So let's go ahead and uh, Get this, let's let's unbox this puppy, man. Let's do it. Ooh, that was smooth. Ooh. This is it. Looks nice, doesn't it? Super nice and clean. All right, so next thing we have up in the box, we have the typical instructions. Like I always say, who needs those guys? Ooh, wow. So in the box, they actually have a larger uh, charging brick, which this is gonna help um, charging it faster. Um, this is actually what you get when you have the iPad Pro. Basically, I think they said in like 30 minutes, you could charge your phone up into 50% or 40%, which is pretty good, but this is an awesome brick. Um, it's also a lightning cable to a USB-C. So basically, if you have any older um, lightning cables, it's probably not gonna work with this brick. So. You just make sure I let you guys know about that. Comes with headphones, the typical headphones. We already know what those headphones are like. And then of course, like I said, the lightning to USB-C charging cable. So that is pretty, pretty cool. So anyway, like I said, this is my old phone. This is my new one. So I'll definitely say holding these two phones, the XS Max and as well as the um, iPhone 11 Pro Max. That's such a long name. They feel from a size perspective, they don't, there's no really difference in that, but this one does feel a little bit weightier, a little bit heavier. On the back of the phone, you can tell the main difference, which is the camera. The older version, the XS Max, we had two, uh, kind of like one lens, and I think they had two, but now we have three lenses on here where it basically is the wide, the super wide, and the telephoto. So that's actually really cool. You get three new type of lenses. Other than that, I think the other difference is larger battery life as well as a better screen. It's so funny about Apple. They don't really change much, but they'll keep charging you. Like, Apple, you have so much of my money. And actually, before I let you all go, please, 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 I used to work at T-Mobile when I was in college. Get yourself a screen protector and a case. I cannot, uh, guys, I'm telling you, because you're gonna be like, no, I don't I don't need it. This feels so nice and it does feel really nice, but as soon as you drop it and it cracks, you're not gonna wanna pay the three, $400 it's gonna take to get it fixed. So my two favorite cases, uh, well, my favorite brands for cases and screen protectors, Tech 21 beyond like anything. I've been swearing by Tech 21. When I used to work at T-Mobile, I used to like throw my phone across the room with a Tech 21 case and a Tech 21 screen protector. And like literally people were like, whoa, what are you doing? And, uh, and I was like, oh, it's not broken. I prayed every time I threw it that it wouldn't break and it didn't, so that was good. But that's something to keep in mind. Um, last off, so this is Pure Gear. Like I said, I typically like to stick with Tech 21, but Pure Gear is one of the brands at T-Mobile that I do, um, I would say is a good brand to have for your screen protector. Another one is the Tech 21 Invisible Shield. The guy at T-Mobile was telling me that they've been having some issues with it peeling off, so I wouldn't do that. Tech 21 or Pure Gear, it even has a really good way to app apply it so you don't get those bubbles. Like I'm, ugh, I'm like kind of like real, I'm a real stickler for bubbles. But anyway, that is that guys. I wanted to, I'm super excited. If you have any questions about the iPhone 11 Pro Max that you want me to test, put in the comments below. If you want more videos or you're excited to see more, you wanna make sure you see that vlog that comes out, make sure you go ahead and compile that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll catch y'all later. You already know, embrace the hype.